Greetings and salutations, I'm Keb. Welcome back to this Let's Play of Sid Meier's Colonization as the Dutch on Viceroy and on the Americas map. And it's been quite a few days since I played last, um, so give me a moment to figure out what I was doing. Um, let's see here. I don't recall if I visited these Indian villages. I mean, I have a scout aboard here, but I guess we'll just have to. I don't just want to be sure. I don't want to risk losing any rewards here. Just because of my faulty memory. <laughs> and yeah, we are at war with the Spanish, so we have to be aware of their forces. Let's see, was there anything in particular that I was waiting for to invest in? Um. <laughs> We have all the colonies we want for now. Do I want to train experts? I wonder, they're really expensive. We kinda sorta have to start thinking about getting a proper army here. Statesman would also be nice. Just to get all the um, different advisors and stuff. Do, 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 do I want to go with that? Rather than just generic colonists? Let's get the farmer at the very least. And they're still cheaper than training, say, ore miners. And then, of course, there's the also, also the consideration of um, hardy pioneers, because here's, here's the thing, they come with 100 tools, right? 100 tools right now costs 800. So, a hardy pioneer basically costs 400 to recruit, <laughs> if we want the tools. Yeah. That could actually be kind of useful. So we get, no, we get tools and we get a colonist. For 400. But of course, do you want to pay 800 for tools? <laughs> it's much the same thing with soldiers. You get, they, they, there you get 50 muskets, that's uh, half of that, that's seven, 700 gold deduction. Um, so, yeah, in some total, the cheapest colonist, professional colonist we can recruit right now is the Hardy Pioneer, <laughs> oddly enough. Um, and we do need more tools in order to prep the land. I mean, we barely started with tool production at all. Um, <laughs> heck with it, let's get one at least. Do I want to just get some raw tools though? Probably not. I do want to get some trade goods. So I have options with the natives. I don't know. We'll see if we might find a native that will pay. 400 plus gold for that. <clears throat> yeah, you're going to New Holland. I think you'd already visited this village, but... Yeah, there we go. Okay, so we hadn't been to that one. Um, <laughs> And I need to start looking for things to pirate here. I need to make money. Uh, you have nothing here. Oh, you're in Fort Orange, right? You're not in New Amsterdam. Well, in that case, load up with whatever's available. Uh, 
Did I send you here to make money? Did I? Yeah, I was waiting for this, this town to cross the threshold so I get four. Uh, just four um, Tories. It's gonna take not too long, I hope. We really need to get started with the tool production in Fort Nassau too, so... And I've forgotten to improve the base squares, haven't I? Yeah, let's do that. The squares under the city. You were headed down to that very upset Indian village down there. Ooh, an extra carpenter. Did I not start... Yeah, you, you're already going with your production. You have both of your specialists. Is it blissing in that lacks carpenters and... Professionals? Yeah. Okay, fine. So down to blessing in with you. Uh, do I need, a, I need another lumberjack, right? Yeah, you're training one. That's good then. And after that, we're gonna have to train fishermen and stuffs. Time to get the food production going so that we can at least grow the population. down there, okay. Ship with no cargoes. to Fort Nassau. There might be some goods to pick up there. Uh, you just sit tight. You go south. Uh, yeah, you're right. You were to go to do that and just make sure. Yeah, okay, fine. Now, we did see a ship in Isabella. Hopefully we can slow it down once it emerges. Uh, no change. to really start filling up the ships. Okay, if I park like this, it will hopefully slow him down a bit. Maybe we can catch him. We're still waiting for the fort. There we go, finally Fort Nassau. Fell into the uh, proper slot there. You're immediately gonna start mining silver. I mean, it's still... Silver mining is still profitable. For now, last forever, but it should last long enough. Okay, the Spanish merchantman, come on, that's the one I want to see. Where do you go? You go south. Okay, fine.
Yeah, park there. Let's try to keep an eye on that down ship. Oh, yeah, no, no, that's gonna kill. <laughs> They're probably gonna kill our poor missionary. I'd be very surprised if they didn't attack him. And, well, we do have a soldier. You know what? Um, clear his orders. If you would just let me. There we go. And then activate. Come on. Go and protect the missionary. Let's see if we can withstand the attack. I don't know. That would be the first Indian raid we'd ever have if they do attack. Okay, they don't. Fine then. Okay, come on. Now you're headed north. Ah. Oh right, and now since we have no tools, we get this funny mess. Ah. That's a lot of money, but okay, fine, pay it. And I kind of need to keep these people working here even. Uh, to get the uh, ratio up here so we can get more people into the town, but that's gonna take a long time. Do I want to just start tool production right now? I think I do. And I'm gonna build a blacksmith shop. And then I'm going to use the carpenter and the lumberjack, I think, to generate liberty bells for a while. Good, we got another lumberjack. And that means it's time to train fishermen. Let's see, we're going to lose three food at Turn. Well, not if he goes up there. There we go. Zero balance. Make both of these into fishermen. Mm hmm. Yeah, that seems like an okay plan there. Um, let's see. You head into New Amsterdam for now. There was a little guy down here I need to pick up and bring home. I didn't see the ship go north. I guess the ship only went to Isabella. Tools. Now we're kind of out of tools, I think. Let's see. Is there anywhere we have a cargo of tools? We do have some tools in New Amsterdam. That's our last cargo, though. And tools are now frightfully expensive. and we'll need farmers eventually, but they're kind of full on people for now. Go north to New Holland, they have more room there. And you're new, so let's see. Um, You know what, you go north and finish New Holland. I don't recall if there was a native village that would take uh, trade goods right now. But we did get a scout up here, so let's start exploring a bit. Who needs what? 
Let's start talking to the Aqua first. Tobacco, cigars, and rum. Okay. Don't think we have any of those cargoes available right now. Um. Yeah, sure. Let's be nice. I mean, we are playing a cooperation policy here. Things are going quite well, actually. I mean, we're playing on the highest difficulty and we haven't had a single a native raid. Which is rather awesome. At some point they are gonna attack, but... That merchantman just keeps evading me. It annoys me. Okay, we sold everything there. Can't afford to train another hardy pioneer. Which it's kind of better. I mean, we'd get a colonist plus tools. <laughs> so, if I needed the tools, that's probably what I would have to do. Um, no, I think we're just gonna set sail back to the new world. And there's the newspaper. Now we're gonna make the little blacksmith shop. Orange is now started their uh, weaveries. Uh, what should they build here, though? Hmm. Well, getting the fur trading business would have been good, I suppose. Let's go with that, fur traders. And I probably should start that anyway. Um, yeah, another convert. He probably shouldn't work here, though. I think I'm gonna send him up to New Holland as well. And then there's you, sir. And, wait a second, is, are you fortified here? Yeah, both of you are. Okay, um... Well, I'll have to start... Harvesting uh, timber and starting to actually produce something here. It's another conifer. Um, which of these are coastal? Okay, the southern one. That's fine then. That's the one we're gonna keep. Just so we get a small bonus against the king when the day comes. And we are producing enough food, right? Yeah, that seems fine. Alright, I was supposed to load you up with goods. And so far as you have any. Oh, well, they didn't need trade goods, and we don't have tobacco, we don't have rum, we don't have cigars. Not yet, anyway. So you'll just sit right there in our little trade hub. You go down to the Cherokee capital and see if they want something. And you just wait. There we go. I, so I did, hadn't visited them. But I think that's the last Indian village. I think we've been everywhere now. Okay, that uh, merchantman is somewhere down here, but it's evading me. We're gonna attack this little ship and hopefully win. We did! And we gained 100 muskets, I'll take those. Here's the thing, I really would like to plant a city exactly where this one is located. Um, <laughs> that's a bit of a problem. I could also plant a city right there. But that's gonna be 
I'm very close to the Aztec capital. Would be useful though, because they, they can probably trade me some good stuffs. Uh, you're gonna start if I do this, but that's okay. For now it's okay. You were heading to New Holland. You're gonna wait there until I get the Indian convert up there. You were headed down to New Orleans, or whatever you want to call it. The one down there. Uh, right. Now I'm gonna need to put you guys to work. Somewhere. Farmer's got a farm. And you need to harvest food too. Which means you guys don't have to do that. You can actually make some monies for us. Get some kind of yeah. We need to get the construction crew up here too. Eventually. Yeah, that seems okay. on the rebirth. Good, we find, we got the missionary over there just in time. All missionaries function as experts, and I believe that also applies to uh, uh, all missions that are already established, so... There we go. Now, though, let's see. Not a smith. It's too soon for smith. Magellan wouldn't really give us that much. Washington would be ideal. I mean, he'd certainly boost our military uh, prowess, provided we actually started <laughs> building an army. It's too soon for Las Casas. Um, Franklin, probably not the strongest one, but I really would like to get down to Jefferson. And Payne, even. So there's that, but I think we're gonna go with Washington. I do want the instant promotions. If we do start an Indian war, we really are gonna need to have Washington in our arsenal. Though for now, things are going quite well with the natives. You are probably gonna set sail for Blissingen. I keep harping on it, but I'm just very satisfied with how incredibly uh, tranquil the situation has been with the natives. Uh, almost tempted to sell these guns to the Arawak, but no. We want the guns for ourselves. needs a field and stuff. They need a field. And I need to send a ship south to pick up those colonists eventually. <laughs> Looks like he's just shipping that one little merchantman back and forth between the colonies. Uh, right, of course, we spent all the tools we'd stored up here. Uh, da, 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 da. I hate paying the full price here, but we have to. Wait a second, 600? That's 6 times 2, that's 12. No, it isn't. Um, Um, 
so okay so we pay more than the, what we would pay if we bought the tools here ah I thought we just paid the exact sum uh, of the uh, equivalent number of tools bought in Europe but that's apparently not the case we pay quite a bit extra ah well, in that case I'll have to reconsider buying tools or not okay you guys need tobacco cotton and rum Again with the tobacco. They really like tobacco. So I guess we have to increase tobacco production. If we can. For now they'll just... let's wait. We need... Uh, need quite a few things actually. We need to get something to sell first. Let's see, you go up to New Amsterdam, you'll need to learn a trade. Same with you. Don't have enough tools to keep you all, to keep all the hardy pioneers going, so... Might as well do that. You are definitely going to start chopping some forests. For example, the square that the town is on. Which you just done. There we go, yeah. Let's see now. We want to make as much fur as possible. And we want to keep these forests up, so that's going to be farmed. You need the coastal forests, because that's going to help us with the king in the end game. so... Right, you're here. This town is completely full of people. Um, I suppose the gunsmith is the odd one out here. Maybe it's time to just start getting these buildings up. Ah, come on. Go there. You two just get zero food. Get the lumber mill, get the dock. Get everything going here. I suppose we could check the other villages too, just in case some of them would like, I don't know, trade goods. Uh, if I were really, uh, uh, really, uh, uh, really up, uh, obsessed with this, I would go through and write lists of exactly what each Indian village requires at any given time. It's kind of annoying that you can't see that at a glance. I mean, it would be lovely if you actually gone and asked, it would be nice to know. Have a tooltip that tell, told you exactly what they currently desire. Oh well, can't have everything, I suppose. Uh, uh, and another thing we're out of actually is time. It's time for a break, I think. So we'll do that. Thank you for watching.